Um, can we talk about this whole telling people about Jesus thing? Because um, I it just sounds really good in theory, and it sounds real spiritual and everything. But I can't just walk up to somebody and tell them about Jesus. I mean, I, it doesn't work for me. But I did find a way to share my faith that does work for me. And I'm going to share it with you because maybe it'll work for you too. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Rufina Porterfield, God's favorite, and I want you to get to know him. So click on that subscribe button and meet my God here with me every 7th, 17th, and 27th of each month so that you can get to know the one who loves you more than you can fathom. Okay, let's get into the video. Okay, so what inspired this whole topic was actually something from my very first, one of my very first YouTube videos, which is deleted now. I deleted a whole bunch of my first attempts at YouTube. But anyways, back then, I used to talk about how I was struggling with witnessing to my clients at the time. Now, they knew that I was a Christian. They knew that I went to church every Sunday. They knew like the basic stuff about Christianity, but they also knew that it was, it wasn't just a ritual for me. It was a part of who I was, but I felt like there was something else. Like I felt like I should be doing more. And so I went to God. I was like, what's up? I feel like, am I supposed to be doing something else? I wrote a letter to him, which I actually do every night. I write letters to God every night. It's a part of our relationship. And I asked him straight up, you know, what else do I need to be doing? And he was like, nothing you just be you and I was like that's it he said yeah you just be you and it's funny because one of my favorite favorite artists virtue has a song called you just be you it's crazy how God confirms stuff sometimes but that actually worked a whole lot better than me just walking up to these people going do you know Jesus as your Lord and personal Savior like, that doesn't even sound natural. That doesn't even sound real. So I decided to do it the way God told me to do it. And wouldn't you know, before I knew it, my clients were coming to me. They were asking me about going to church. They were asking me, hey, can we visit your church sometimes? And yes, some of them actually came. I had one client that their family came in on one weekend. And they brought their family to my church without me even knowing until I saw them later. So, yeah, God's way actually works. How about that? Listen, God created you in a very unique way with your own personality type, with your own personal experiences. And all of that goes into your own personal unique relationship with God. And he can use all of that. He will use all of that to show himself to everyone in your environment, to everyone that you know in your circle. He can do that because your unique relationship with him makes you a light in all the dark places there may be, at your school, in your home, on the job, wherever it may be. If Jesus is your Lord, if he is your master, if you can't do life without him, people will notice. Everyone will be able to see that there is something different and they will be drawn to that. And when they do, when they are, when they come to you and question you about what makes you different, don't worry, you'll be ready. Because the great attorney, the great lawyer, the great advocate that Jesus is, he'll make sure that you are ready to testify. He will make sure that you are a good witness. And that's it. That's all the wisdom I have for you today. I guess that's kind of a short video, huh? Listen, if you missed any of the video verses that appeared in this area, 
Don't forget, they'll be in this area. They'll be in the description box below. Don't forget to check out the Meet My God podcast on all of your available podcasting platforms. It's also available on my website, ruthinaporterfield.com. You can go to that website to also book me for your next event, workshop, retreat. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. Until the next time, peace, stay cool, 